Oh my gosh, honey, you scared me. What does it look like I'm doing? I'm making dinner. The kids? They're at your parents' house. Hence, me only wearing an apron. What? Well, this was supposed to be a surprise. The occasion? Hmm. I don't know. I just love you. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. <laughs> How's work, baby? Good? Oh, well, my day was pretty hectic. Did you get a voicemail too? Yeah, well, Bella got in trouble at school today. Again. Yeah, her teacher called and said that when she asked Bella to answer a question or something, she said, and I quote, no. And then when the teacher decided to pull her after class and asked why she refused, she responded with, I have rights and no means no. <laughs> I mean, we definitely have to have a talk with her about her impressively off-putting attitude towards other adults. But at the same time, it's like, she's not wrong. I, I don't know who she gets it from, but anytime she does something, she always has a valid explanation. So as much as discipline would be necessary, she's technically never in the wrong. Oh, she gets it from me? I mean, I guess. <laughs> My parents always told me I should be a lawyer. And when I grew up, I learned that that's how adults say that a child is being a pain in the ah, ah! Baby! Ow! Not cool. Because I'm cooking. Oh my goodness. Mm. Hmm? Dinner will be ready in a minute. But mm. perhaps you can have a little appetizer right now. <laughs> mm -hmm. Does this do it for you? Hmm? Me in an apron. Yeah. <laughs> mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. So I should do this more often, huh? <laughs> Baby, we already have two kids. We'd have a football team if I did this more often. <laughs> I, I don't know. I just feel like we've been so busy and you've been working so much and the kids keep me so busy that I barely have time to do my work. So it's like the only free time I have to get anything done and focus is when you come home and spend time with them, which also prompts these kinds of surprises, don't you think? <laughs> I mean, it's very, very attractive watching you be a dad. I mean, I've been with five different people since we've met. I've seen you as a friend, a boyfriend, fiance, and a husband. Now I get to watch you be a father and to say that I'm proud of you would be an understatement. No, I mean it. I, I really do love our little family, even though our kids are insane. <laughs> mm. But you know, I'd love you a little bit more if you maybe helped cook from time to time. Maybe chop some vegetables or something. Just be like useful. <laughs> I'm kidding, baby. Obviously, the last time you were in the kitchen, the smoke detector went off and I had to tell the firefighters that nothing is wrong. My husband just can't cook. <laughs> oh, well, that's true. You are good at breakfast foods, but baby, making eggs and toast isn't that hard. I mean, I learned how to make eggs when I was like five. Did I drop the spoon in it a few times? Sure, but I didn't burn the eggs and that's what matters. Anyways, I say all that to say that I want us to spend more time together. Whether that's cooking, date nights, I, I just want more time for us. 
And I know it's hard now that we have kids and all, but maybe we take a trip, a little weekend getaway, maybe, maybe to a cabin since it's cold. Yeah, I've always wanted to do that. Have a hot tub, bonfire, no responsibilities other than potentially expanding our family. Mm -hmm. I'm kidding. We aren't having any more kids. Maybe one more. Maybe. But I just got my body back to where I don't feel insecure. So let me enjoy this. Yeah, and those six weeks that follow are always hell. I mean, being pregnant was nice, but at the same time, do I miss not being able to see what you're doing down there? Not really. (laughs) But we should really get away for a little while. Maybe have some family watch the kids more often. I know, I know. Mm. I hate being away from the kids too, but it's like... I miss you, baby. (laughs) I do. I miss you a lot. Mm. Mm -hmm. You miss me too? Really? How much? (laughs) Mm. Baby, you're so handsy. Mm. Yeah, well, maybe don't grab me by the stove. (laughs) Oh, the food is ready. Here, let me get a spoon. Here. Peace. Wait, it's hot. Okay, open your mouth. There we go. Oops. Did I get some on your neck? Oh no, I think I have to clean that up. Mm hmm. Turn your head. Turn your head. Mm hmm. Mm, tastes good. <laughs> Here, let's try this again. Okay. Oops. <laughs> it looks like I got some on my chest. You want to get it for me? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh, baby. On the counter? 